Liam Mortis with Tis the Law Retired. That's right, Tis the Law. Three year old getting ready to turn four. Won the Belmont. Won four great races. Out of Constitution. I think he's going to be one of the better stallions out there. This will be his, Tis the Law's out of his first crop. There's going to be a lot more. Of course, Constitution is out of Tappet, who's out of Pulpit. The mare side is Tiz now. You can't beat that kind of lineage. The assistant trainer, Robin Smullins, Smullins, brought it to the attention. She's an assistant trainer. She brought it, and she's the one that works the horse. We're probably closer to the horse than anybody. A lot of times, these trainers, big trainers, which are, Barkley Clay's the excellent trainer, but a lot of times, somebody down the line does almost everything for the horse. If not every time. She knew someone right with a horse and she knew something was wrong, wasn't the same. I have a feeling that, I mean, maybe just make excuses for him, but I have a feeling it's been going on a lot longer than he realized. He broke his maiden at Saratoga and a New York bred one big time. Then he went on the next year as a three year old, won the Holy Bull at Gulf Stream, the Florida Derby at Gulf Stream. I think he would have won the Kentucky Derby, I really do, if it had been ran in May, if it wasn't for COVID and, of course, Authentic. Mess that stuff, mess that up. When he finished sixth in the Breeders' Cup, he didn't even fire, he just ran. Uh, I knew something was wrong with him. Well, I, I, I thought his racing good days were over, I'll say it that way. Like I said, he's a big bay horse, got a big white blaze down the front, you can't miss him. I actually drove one time about 60 or 70 miles just to see him train and from a distance, of course, never did see him, seen every horse but him. Like I said, he won four grade ones. Um, Champagne is a two-year-old at Saratoga. Travers is a three-year-old at Saratoga. Of course, the Florida Derby and the Belmont. Like I said, I believe he would have won the Kentucky Derby, but oh well. Who will never know. Can't, can't take nothing away from authentic. So that about wraps it up. It's another another horse return early. I really hate it because I was really looking forward to his, not just his whole four-year se season. I was looking forward, I was also looking for him to run in the Pegasus World Cup. I mean, that was still going to be a great race, but it takes a little wind out of myself. I was excited about seeing him run in that race and proving himself. But take down what was right for the horse or thinking of the horse. Well, and they're also thinking that if he, that would be a fatal injury if he got hurt. Could be a fatal injury, and then, you know, they'd be out of everything on that. So they did what was right for the horse and themselves. But good luck, everybody.